Red Queen's race. Cause any interest in Apsaps? Sure, a bunch of old Brit farts and powdered wigs shouting, Off with their heads! You know, you're allowed to say you don't have a clue. Oh, well, well. well. Hold it! Stop right there! Slow your roll! River Ward, NCPD. Police. Let him in? Let him wait. It's important. Thoughts? Did you uh, see anything suspicious? Anything at all? Or are we paranoid? Whole thing stinks worse than Coronado Bay in July. Huh. So suspicions confirmed. Any questions at this point? The conference. Why was it held? For no particular reason. Ryan liked the sound of his voice and seeing himself on TV. <laughs> yeah, that sort of thing. As far as I recall, the drop in Night City's violent crime rate was the excuse for this one. Ryan came out to tout it. Sorry, drop? Ryan reclassified Pacifica an independent district. Stats for that part of town stopped counting. Ha, huh. clever. Who's Holt? Ryan's deputy, and his bulldog, so to speak. Running in Ryan's place now. Red Queen's race. What is it? Got me. Never heard of it. Sorry. Cop who saved Ryan. Know anything about him? Detective River Ward. Good guy. We worked a few cases together. You want to talk to him, I'll put you in touch. Anyone else besides Ryan's detail have access to the terminal? Hmm. NCPD. That's it. Mayor's Hustle. They NCPD? No. All handpicked by Holt. And on a corpse payroll. But there are ex-cops among them. Sheesh. Ward had great timing. Either has crazy good luck or had a source. Got good info. I'm gonna need some of each. Well said. I'm sending you his deeds. If you need anything else, let us know. We'll help. Name's V. Looking into the death of one Lucius Rhine. Wonder why? You're not a cop. Listen, I know you tried to warn Ryan about the cyberpsycho. What else do you know? That you'd best meet with me. All right. I'm headed to Chubby Buffaloes. Be there, staff.
I have an important message for you. Say anything to continue. Hit me with it. While running a routine diagnostic check, I discovered a file with my owner's metadata. Name, Regina Jones. User, please return me to my real owner. Thank you in advance. Okay, I'll take you to Regina. You are the best user I know. June, I'm the only user you know. Your memory got wiped. Fun fact. There is a 92% probability Regina Jones will reward you. Someone here to see you, looks like. Huh. Wonder what about? You, River Ward? In the flesh. V, right? My partner, Detective Hun. Mind if we step off to the side? Hun and me, we're like one mind. Got no secrets. You really intend to work with a merc? Don't know what I intend just yet. For now, I'm gonna see if I hear anything new about Ryan's death. You back on that? Boss already told you to drop it. He can say it again. You know he hates to say things twice. And if you couldn't give a rat's fat ass about any of that, heed my advice, as your friend. Just let the case go. You see me do anything? I'm just sitting here, sipping coffee, listening to gossip. Fine. Do what you want. I'm not about to be partners. Gotta go get my little girl anyway. And you two at least find a quieter corner. Wouldn't want to be overheard. Okay. Talk. See, Detective Han's not a fan of edge runners. Don't take it personally. Detective Han's not a fan of anybody, except his daughter. You wanted to talk? For the attack, you wanted to talk to Ryan's hustle. It's an info to him. What was it? Let me ask you a question first. Why do you got your nose in this? Who hired you? Liz Perales hired me. And her husband, Jefferson. The presumed future mayor. <laughs> Guess I could have seen that coming. What? Han was right. Acoustics are a little too good in here. Got my car outside. Okay, sure. Some of the boys from the precinct saw Horvath around Arroyo, shooting up dumpsters, hollering how he's got to meet with the mayor. Brought him in. Brought who in? Peter Horvath. Cyber psycho who attacked the mayor later. They took him downtown, but then he got lost before they could get his statement. Said he got lost. How's that happen? What's it mean? It means someone didn't want him counting roaches in a cell that day. And before you ask me, no. I got no idea who. My turn. Why is Perales looking at this now? Why does he want it done unofficial on the hush-hush? Perales could just be scared. Doesn't want the job of a guy who just got carried out feet first? Who would? As I see it, Perales is out to smear Holt. So he thinks Holt's involved? Dunno. But even if he's not, a murdered mayor isn't great optics for his deputy. Red Queen's race. Heard anything about it? Know what it is? Maybe I have. Maybe I do. It got anything to do with Ryan? Guy was headed there the day he died. <sighs> Fine. We're gonna see my CI. 
All I've heard is some fancy ass club. No idea where to even look for it. See, I might not. Then we'll go talk to the woman Horvath worked for. Or actually, we could see her first. Up to you. Sorry, we? Can't shake this case. Something's up. Just look how quickly it was closed. This way, you can get your job done, while I find evidence that gets my chief to reopen the case. Win-win. So, where to first? Let's go see your informer. Club's a better lead. Fine with me. guy works here. You go talk to him. I'll wait outside. Tell him Igor says hi. He'll know what it's about. He's your CI. Doesn't know me. Well, uh, last we met it didn't go so well. For him. People he ratted out got wind of it. I think you got a better chance of getting him to talk without me. At least voluntarily. Who is this guy? The proud proprietor. He's got all sorts of clients, and he's nosy as hell. So he knows all about everyone. Plus, he's a coward. Perfect combo. All right, wait here then. Looking for a uh, general inspiration or something specific? Because I can help with both. Looking for a club? Red Queen's race? If I was you, I'd try somewhere a little more welcoming. Lizzie's over in Kabuki is a good start. Or Clouds in Japantown. Want an address? Look, club's invitation only, right? You don't know the address. It means you're not welcome. Mr. Igor says hi. Fuck, no. Said I was done. I was out. To be slow. Tiancha, come back. The fuck alone. All of One question to ask you. Nothing to see here, sir. Come on, ghost, I said. Leave me alone, got it? Can't make me do a damn thing. We can, actually, and we will. Just tell us where to find Red Queen's race. I don't know! I know people! We could be smart about it! So fucking remember! And make it quick! Alright! Jesus! Chill, okay? It's outside city limits. Near the river. Benita Street area. You been there? Not telling you another fucking thing. Kiss my ass. Both of you. Well, well. That's what I call a breakthrough. Seems promising, but I'd still hit that market. Mar 
Hang on. Be right back. Okay, I'm back. Talk. Morvoth's employer, one I mentioned before. I just wouldn't let that lead drop. Okay. Let's go see this market of yours. We're gonna take my car? Sure. Thanks. Good 90% of any detective's job is talking. How about we change tacks this time? Ask questions first, then level threats. And the other 10%? What's it consist of? Writing reports. So who are we supposed to talk to? Cyber Psycho's boss, you said? Christine Markov, 42. File has her as Horvath's sole employer. Sole contact, too, actually. Come on, V. No idea who we're looking for. Gonna have to ask around. I'll start from the left, you take the right. Christine Markov? No, but I know who she is. Stand with the tech over on the other side. Christine Markov? Me? No, she's over there. Stall with the tech. Thanks. Christine Markov, we have some questions. You badges? Looking for data on Petar Horvath. Worked here, apparently? Yeah, he did. Then he stopped working, started making fucking speeches all the time. When did the weird behavior actually start? When you're talking about Petar... Weird doesn't mean what it means for everybody else. Horvath never was completely normal. For the post-jail Horvath versus the pre-jail Horvath, gonks both, but completely different gonks. 
Horvath make good scratch here? Could have bought this whole market with the chrome he was packing. <laughs> oh yeah, made scads on scads here. <laughs> Motherfucking millionaire, like we all are. So where'd he get the eddies? Know anything? Look, if I knew, I wouldn't be here selling scop to tower trash. I'd get myself an AV, fly my fucking slim ass out of here. Peta showed up one day with all that. Extra worked up, too. Whacked enough that I asked him where he got it. He said somebody finally seen what he was worth. And then he launched right into one of his tirades. These speeches. What did he have to say? Ryan, corpse got him by the balls and cock, but he still managed to fuck me. His motto. Why'd he have it in for the mayor? Ha! <laughs> Looking for reason in that whack job? Probably thought Ryan was talking to him through the TV, promising all sorts of shit, then ceasing to give a fuck. Look, I told you what I think. In Horvath's world, everybody was out to get him. Lucius Ryan was out to fuck him, then get him. So as Horvath saw, who else had it in for him? Besides Ryan? A madame president, mostly. Then Arasaka, the Giza, and when he died, it was a son's turn. Would that be all, detectives? You're spooking my clientele. Somebody'd finally seen what he was worth. Horvath had sponsors. We might have guessed as much. Might seem like we didn't get a lot out of that. But sometimes intel makes sense once you've got some context. Say, for instance, somebody says they got a headache. Minor detail. Means nothing, right? Usually, sure. But then the guy waltzes straight into oncoming traffic. A neighbor remembers someone had worked on the air conditioner in the guy's unit. Guy whose head always hurt. Accident? Coincidence? Or maybe air dispersed poison? A deliberate hit. You actually caught a case like that? No. Made it up. Still proves my point. Oh, great. Let me handle this, V. Step aside, Lug. Your boyfriend got sent up for years. Doubt you want the same. Fuck off, Kitty Claus. V. Fuck off! Walking the streets with you? <laughs> Downright unsafe. Got a beef with all gangs or just the tigers? I'm a cop. What do you think? Uh, gotta report this. Okay. Red Queen's race now. First, I gotta clean up the mess you made. We'll meet there.
well, hey? Animals turf. Any sly cop rules for talking to them? Scratch their tummies. Don't expose your throat. Ha fucking ha. We're short of warrant, so you're on your own. You find anything, tell me. Found a side door. Animals are letting their guard down. Probably haven't checked it out in ages. <laughs> 